are getting ready to make your big PIX debut to talk a little bit about Jamaican food, about Jamaica. Just tell us what's going to your mind right now. Greetings, Tony. Here I am in New York City, one of the greatest cities in the world. And here at WPIX Channel 11 Morning News on Labor Day. And of course, Labor Day, what do Caribbeans do? They're on the parkway, West Indian Day Parade. And Jamaica, being the heartbeat of the Caribbean, we're here to showcase the destination, our culture, our cuisine. All right? We have some nice mango barbecue, salmon with potato salad. So that's at the top of the morning for you. All right? So watch, watch me live as we promote Jamaica, our beautiful land we love. One and love. How long have you been at the Jamaica Tourist Board? You want me to tell my age? <laughs> <laughs> Since I was a little bitty, yes, quite some time, yes. And you actually came to feel not, I mean, as a beauty pageant winner. Tell us a little bit about that. Yes, at the time I began working with the Jamaica Tourist Board in 1998 in New York City, I was also crowned that year Miss Jamaica USA. And it was just a fabulous time you know, representing for Jamaica in New York. And lastly, tell us about this outfit because it's representing Jamaica in many, many ways. <laughs> well, of course, Jamaica being a very colorful nation, I'm wearing the red, green, and gold colors. And it just speaks of the vibrancy of Jamaica and our people and our culture. And again, one more question. What makes Jamaican food so, you know, a lot of people from all over the world want to taste some Jamaican food? Well, I think it's because it's so well known around the world. So if you haven't tasted it, you've heard about it. And so that's the attraction that you want to try these delectable flavors. But what makes it so popular is that, like Jamaica itself, our food is very diverse. As a nation, Jamaica, our motto is out of many white people. So it's a collider scope of influences, even in our foods. You know, Chinese, Indian, Arab, African, European. And so it's a kaleidoscope of flavors coming together. And so you find that, you know, it appeals to a diverse palate. Something for everyone. All right, Vicky, all of this. Yeah, man.